us out early that warm August day. Our Warwickshire lads had been sent far away to a camp in the northeast preparing for war. Most not yet twenty, so young and so raw. They'd been marching all morning in sweltering heat, sweating, exhausted, half dead on their feet. Arriving in Blythe Town, they were ordered to rest. And bathe in the North Sea before their next test. Six hundred soldiers went on to the beach, laughing and joking along the tide's reach. But the joy of that moment would soon turn to grief. When the pull of the current took men underneath. Lieutenant Colonel Chatterley sat high on his horse, anxiously watching more waves changing course. His charges were swimming near to the land. But the wild swirling sea was beyond his command. Sergeant John Riley was just back from France. He dived in to save them. But stood little chance Some waded out bravely Grabbed five with their hands But nine lives were taken That day on Blythe Sands The youngest to die Was a boy from King's Heath His father stood dumbstruck in sheer disbelief This cannot have happened Poor Mrs. Blunt said She couldn't believe Her Jesse was dead At the inquest on Monday There were questions to ask Swim there was madness, one fisherman claimed, but the jury decided no one should be blamed. Lieutenant Colonel Chatterley sat high on his horse, anxiously watching more waves changing course. His charges were swimming near to the land, but the wild swirling sea was beyond his command. The sun was out early that warm August day.